Good morning, guys, and welcome to a new vlog. Here's Sherry. Good morning. She's enjoying her baking Gouda. And then she also got an Americana. She got the grande today. And then I got my coffee. They didn't put a lot of almond milk in this. I mean, it's fine. Maybe it's just more bitter because I'm used to my coffee that I make at home. And maybe I was just putting... It's still good, but still. I don't know. We went to Starbucks. Sherry's arm is doing a little bit better. She's waiting for her CT scan results. I'm giving like a little update here okay. but she's walking like a lot better and so i said well if you want starbucks you have to come with me so she did anything for the starbucks now i need to go to pet boys to get air in my tires dude i just got new tires i'm like why but it has gotten cold so i think it's just like the weather change but still it's annoying so i just started some laundry upstairs and i'm debating on cleaning these these are my hokas and they're so dirty. We're not gonna talk about it, but I've decided these are not my OR shoes anymore because they actually hurt my feet, which is so bad, but they're like cute for aesthetic and like, because they're kind of trendy, I will like still keep wearing them just like to run errands, to go out with like friends. I don't know, they're just really cute. I have deemed my running shoes my OR shoes because they're just a lot more like snug around my feet. I've had these for a good minute when I started my running journey. I don't even know when that was. They're just so good. And honestly, my feet don't hurt as bad when I get home after like my 10 hour shifts because today's Friday, which is awesome. I'm going to do a little life update later in this vlog. But yeah, I don't know. I just, these are just so much better. And I just wear the booties. Um, so you don't really see the pink. I was thinking about getting like a black pair or like a white pair of that same shoe. I think it's on my like to know it. So I'm going to check that out. You can check it out too if you want those shoes, but they're really good for like long periods standing and stuff. Don't get me wrong. Like I like the Hoka's, but I don't think they're like meant for me. <laughs> If I'm being honest, those are definitely not my OR shoes anymore. Okay, so I kind of wanted to do like a little life update and share with you guys like what my new schedule is for work, which is so crazy to say work. I'm just like really happy and grateful that I have a full-time job now and I'm in orientation. So basically, and what I've learned too is like the terminology for things is really different from like my other previous positions. Like orientation is basically like training like on the job real life training that the hospital puts you through and this training happens like basically around six months like it could be sooner it could be later that you're in orientation and i'll probably be like in orientation like longer than other people because like i'm so new but we'll see i don't mind because again like i'm so new to this so far everyone's been really nice and i've already learned a lot and i've only been in the operating room for like two days but like now i'm really doing things so i'm happy about that my schedule is monday through thursday 4 10 so i start around like 6 45 and end at 5 15 ish basically it's not that bad especially when you're busy like when you're doing when you're working and like you're not looking at the time or anything like time goes by it pretty fast so i'm happy about that i'm filming this on friday and it's so nice um but i still like to stay on my schedule so i always go to bed strictly like at 9 30. my mom's getting a call i always go to bed super early and then i wake up pretty early so i went to bed at 10 yesterday and Today I woke up around like 7.30 like sleeping in, but I know that's not like that late to sleep in, but basically I get up around like five every morning. So I love four tens. I love having a three day weekend every day. Now my schedule could change and it probably will change because they put the people like they need on certain days. So I might do 312s. I don't know. I hope not because like I just think that's so hard. Yeah, I don't know. Like your eating times would be even more different. My eating times haven't really changed. So that's good. I don't know what else to say about it. It's really weird going to a job and like clocking in again. Like an actual like time thing mounted to the wall and like it's touch screen because I had that at Universal. But it's been so, so long since I've actually done that. So basically at like all my other jobs, 
I've just put in my hours like on this thing called ADP and now I'm back to Kronos. So Kronos is like a timekeeping schedule. Universal used it too, but it's kind of like ADP, but it's different at the same time. You just go in and like log your time, but like for this job, I actually like punch in as what they say. So basically I swipe my ID kind of like I did at Universal, which is like, interesting at least i've like had that experience before because if i hadn't then i'd be like so worried to get there like on the dot because if you're like one minute late you're considered late so that's definitely like been a change because i was used to like kind of there wasn't like a set time like i mean obviously you don't want to be like an hour or more late but like it wasn't or even half an hour for that matter but like there wasn't a set time that i needed to be at work it was just kind of like, oh, you just like log in that you worked eight hours, you know? So, and I got an hour for lunch always at my old job, but now I only have 30 minutes. So there's definitely no way I'm going to like not pack a lunch. And you guys know, I always eat like the same things. So I just take my eggs and pretzels, celery, all of that, and just eat it there. Cause we don't have a lot of time, um, but that's fine. Like I'm kind of used to, that lunch obviously since I've been eating it since forever. It's not that big of a deal because I always am able to finish my lunch. But if I didn't bring lunch and I would need to like go somewhere like to the hospital across the street or just to the cafeteria, there is no way I would be able to finish my meal. Like, I don't know, I already eat slow in general. So, um, but other than that, that's pretty much my life update. I do plan on getting videos up. So like two to three videos still, cause I have a three day weekend that I can like film and edit. Cause you guys know, I'm never gonna stop this. I'm never gonna stop TikTok and Instagram and all of that stuff. Like I do not plan on stopping any of that, but it's nice to know that I'm not like relying on this for like income, even though like I do get really fun, good hobby money from this, but like it's not sustainable for like everyday living. I wish it was like, that would be so cool. I'm not a niche creator. I'm not gonna like gain that much traction. So it's like some people like these types of videos, some people like those types of videos. And so yeah, it just fluctuates, but I like posting what I like to post. Today I've just been uh, doing a lot of house chores. So I like cleaned the house, did the dishes, finished up some laundry. That's pretty much it. Took mother out. We went to Starbucks as you saw earlier. Fed, walked the dog. Okay, so it's much, much later now. And I'm actually just watching Emily's video that she just posted. She's like my favorite Disney uh, blogger, vlogger, whatever. But then my mom reminded me that the celebration pancake breakfast is tomorrow. So we got these shirts. And I think it was supposed to have her name on it. They'll like put it like on it later, I guess. Essentially what Rotary is, it's like a global like international club that does like good things for the community and stuff. So I'm a part of it here in celebration and apparently the pancake breakfast is tomorrow and it was in my calendar, but I'd like forgotten about it. Long story short, I'm definitely going to bed early tonight because I have to get up at 5.15 so I can be at like the location to help set up for the run and the pancake breakfast tomorrow. The weather is supposed to be like pretty nice out. It's like 67, but I am gonna wear jeans so I can just like be hands-free and just put my phone in my pocket and stuff. So I was gonna wear these leggings, but we're not gonna do that. And I'm glad that my mom was like, oh, the pancake breakfast tomorrow because I literally forgot. Like, oh man, that would suck because I told the people like I was gonna volunteer and that would make me look like a horrible person if I just didn't show up. I know I'm laughing about it, but it wouldn't have been funny if that had actually happened. Gonna wear the shirt. Need to put that out to remind myself like wear that. We had Panera. The people almost forgot to put my salad and stuff like in the bag. So that was a thing. It's been a pretty chill day. Like I said, did chores and stuff. But tomorrow I'm hoping to get some footage of the pancake breakfast maybe. I'll show you guys around. Then I have to give Sherry a shower. So that's going to be fun and exciting. <laughs>
so pancake breakfast was so fun and basically I just passed out water with some high school kids that go to like the local high school so that was fun I had them like airdrop me some of the footage they got so that's what you saw like part of this and then I took like a little overview of the pancake breakfast the last event that I participated in I think it was a little bit more crowded because like there wasn't a run portion of the event so um, I think there was like more people to get pancakes but overall this year was pretty successful and I'm glad I didn't forget about going because I was like about to forget. Whew, man, I'm so tired. I did not sleep that well last night because I actually wasn't that tired because I got like a really good rest or like night sleep before. I wasn't tired, but I had to go to sleep because I knew I had to get up early. I was like trying to sleep, but it wasn't like the best quality, which is fine. But I know tonight I'm gonna sleep well because I am so tired. Yeah, I am going to do my everything shower in just a minute. Then I think I'm gonna edit this video because I really want to try to get like at least two videos up, but that probably won't happen. Uh, but I'll start filming a new video. My next video, I want to like do an experiment for my hokas. Like I'm going to put them in the wash. That'll be a fun video and we'll see how they turn out because I am not the type to like be cleaning shoes like manually. I've never really cleaned shoes, so <laughs> I think I'm gonna end the video here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I need to just get like into my schedule and stuff and not need or feel the need to have relaxing time all the time. But I don't know. I give myself some grace, at least for the first week of work. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.